Just four light years away from Earth sits the closest exoplanet that scientists have discovered, Proxima Centauri b. And it could be the first exoplanet where we find extraterrestrial life. <laughs> Who better to check it out than our interstellar teammate, Chase? Yeah, it's true I've died on every exoplanet I visited, but this time will be different. Proxima Centauri B has to work out. It's literally so close to Earth that I could DoorDash my tuna pizza order, like regular. Initiate landing on Proxima Centauri B. All right. Oh man, this is sweet. Proxima Centauri B is located in the habitable zone of its host star, but just because it's in the habitable zone doesn't mean it's habitable. And just because I die on a planet doesn't mean it's not habitable. Though he could have said it better, Chase isn't wrong. Proxima Centauri is a red dwarf star, which makes it very different from the Earth's sun. As a red dwarf, it's much smaller and cooler. It's also a lot more efficient at burning through all of its hydrogen supply. And that means that Proxima Centauri has a lot longer lifespan than the sun. Its star, Proxima Centauri, only gives off about 0.1% of the sun's brightness. That means that Proxima Centauri b has to orbit much closer to its star to get enough energy to potentially support life. And being too close to a red dwarf star comes with some dangerous consequences. Ugh, don't tell me. The solar flares? I always forget about the solar flares. That's right, this red dwarf star gives off deadly, unpredictable blasts of extreme radiation. These eruptions carry so much energy that they could strip away the planet's atmosphere. Proxima Centauri b has another dark secret. It's tidally locked with its star. Only one side of Proxima Centauri b is facing its star, and that side is forever exposed to light. The other side, shrouded in endless darkness. Oh man, this is tough. Oh, I know. I'll live in the Terminator Zone. The Terminator Zone is the area between the day side and the night side of a planet. On a tidally locked planet like this one, the Terminator Zone stays in place. Got the chopper! Arrived at the Terminator Zone. All right, let's get to work. I'm making all of this radiation proof. You know, with the amount of UV this guy's blasting off, we have to insulate everything. I'm gonna take a quick trip over to the night zone, you know, cool off a little bit, have myself a little cocktail. See if there's any space ladies over there. Uh, well, it looks like we lost Chase to the darkness of Proxima Centauri b, which is too bad. He doesn't actually come back unless he dies. Looks like Proxima Centauri b isn't as promising of an exoplanet. But don't worry, Chase will be back 